Holla. Hey guys, it's me. Um, I just dropped my husband off for his game, his like weekly gaming game game. Oh, I want to show you guys my outfit really cute. I don't know if you can see it, but I'm wearing this like, this used to be a maxi dress. And I took it to the altar because I owe a sewing machine, but I can't really sew that well. So, and I didn't want to mess it up. Anyway, I took it to an alteration place and they, and I had them cut it off like right at my knee, like right above my knee. Or like right at the top of my knee, not above, it like, it touches my knee, anyway. But I don't know if you guys can see it or not, and then I have like my awesome biker boots on. Anyway, I just thought it was a cute outfit and I thought you guys might enjoy it. But, what I was going to say is, I read online yesterday, the day before yesterday, about, I'm waiting on my best friend to get here. Anyway, my best girlfriend. Anyway, I read online about Kristen Stewart and the whole Robert Pattinson thing. Pattinson? 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 And about her, like, making out with her Snow White and the Huntsman director or whatever. And my best friend is, like, a fiend over these Twilight movies. And so I was telling her about it. I was like, hey, did you hear about this? And she was just like, no, I didn't hear about it. And she was like, I'm going to choose not to believe it for right now until, like, I guess she said something like until I see more evidence or until they come out and say it or something like that. And so I was like, okay, well, I'm just letting you know, like, that's some interesting stuff going on. And anyway, excuse me one second. Anyway, I was on Perez Hilton today. Just looking up stuff because it's like one of the websites I go to like every day. Hey, pardon me. I'm hot because I've been like cleaning and straightening things up. It's not super clean. I mean, look at our room. There's still like messy stuff hanging around. There's Taylor Bear. Anyway, it's better. Let's just say that. So I was on Perez Hilton earlier today just looking at stuff. And um, the dude that Kristen Stewart cheated with, who is married to a model and they have two young kids, not like babies, but they're like young. She released a statement and he released a statement. So now it's like, well, you can't deny it. I mean, there were pictures in like one of the tabloids um, of them like making out or whatever. And that's kind of like hard to deny once you see pictures of it to begin with. But then, um, and I, to I even told her about the pictures and she was just like, no, I choose not to believe it. And I know like a lot of Twilight fans are saying that, like, it was photoshopped and whatever else, but it wasn't. It was, like, for real. And then later, I logged back on the website to go, like, check out stuff, and she, Kristen Stewart, had released a statement, and this director dude released a statement. So I'm like, yeah, dude, it's for real. Like, they really did cheat. And what's sad about it is, like, it's sad when anybody cheats. I mean, it, it sucks, right? But what's really sad about it to me is that, like, he didn't hear it. Robert... Assumingly, Robert Pattinson, 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 whatever. I, I haven't watched the Twilight movies, so sue me. Apparently, I mean, he didn't find out from her directly. You know, this poor kid probably saw the pictures just like everybody else and found out that way. And it's just, I mean, people cheat and it's very unfortunate. And, you know, I'm hoping the relationship is good enough and strong enough, like, in the end, where maybe they can work through whatever issues they had that made her feel like she needed to do that or she had a right to do that. But the thing is, is, like, I feel bad for him because, you know, how would you like to feel that, you know, how would you like to find out that your girlfriend cheated on you or is cheating on you, whatever the case may be, by, like, you know, reading it on the Internet and not having that person tell you, I want to come clean to you, I want to tell you. I messed up. I did something bad. I just feel bad for him, you know. So, when my best friend gets here, though, <laughs> this is horrible. When she gets here, I want to get, like, video of her reaction to the statements. Like, I want to conversate with her about it and see what she thinks. Because, you know, she might have, like, a different take on it than I do. But I just feel bad for him because it's like, your girlfriend didn't come to you because she felt guilty about it. You had to find out about it on the Internet, like everybody else, assumingly. Like, of course, I don't know. Who knows, really? You know, we don't know. You know, but it's just like, she's like, her statement is just like, I feel so horrible about this. I mean, they confirmed that this went down. Like, they didn't deny it. Nobody denied it. I mean, how can you deny it when you have the proof staring people in the face? You can't. Like, what are you going to say? You know? No, I didn't do it. Hold on.